Hello, I hope everybody is well. It's New Year's Eve here, and I uh, probably won't get this posted till New Year's Day, but for the very last video on the Helen Lee channel uh, of 2020, I did something totally weird. Um, I did a makeup video. I just decided I didn't wanna address politics or uh, any of the other crazy stuff that has gone on this year. I just thought it would be a nice escape to do something different. And so that's what I did. So um, I wanna wish all of you a very, very happy new year. Here's to a wonderful 2021. And thank you so much for watching the Helen Lee channel. It means so much to me and um, I really appreciate the new subscribers I've gotten and your loyalty and I hope you enjoy this video and I will see you next year. Hey guys, I have uh, something different for you today. Um, I got some fabulous new makeup from Jamie and Diane for my birthday and I've been meaning to tell you about it. So I thought I would share with you while I'm getting ready, we're gonna walk next door for dinner. It's actually New Year's Eve and uh, we're gonna walk next door for dinner, so I thought I'd get glammed up, even though I'm just wearing jeans and a black sweater, and show you what I got and tell you what I love. So I started out with um, a foundation that I bought. They didn't get me that, but I discovered it through the samples that came in some of the stuff that Jamie gave me. And um, it's this Bobbi Brown, this Bobbi Brown um, skin foundation. I love it. It is smells good and it's really light, and um, I don't know, I just really like it. So then of course I put my NARS concealer on, and um, I'm sorry I didn't start out naked faced, but I scared myself, and so I knew I would probably scare you too. Then Diane gave me this um, Chanel eyeshadow palette, which is gorgeous. It is called Le Beige, and I think I'm gonna use, or, no, the other one. Jamie gave me this Wayne Goss eyeshadow palette, which is uh, gorgeous as well. I mean, they're both just really the nicest eyeshadows I've ever had. I feel like a Vanderbilt using it all. So anyway, I think I'll do the Wayne Goss this time. And, um, oh, I bought, a, bought myself a Charlotte Tilbury Pillow Talk blush. And I bought, actually got the um, eyeshadow quad that goes with that, but, um, I'll save that for another time too. So I am so ready for, first I'm gonna start out with um, my Laura Mercier La, no, on natural, I think. It's just a base, always do that. Two mirrors going here. One is not enough when you get to be 58. I love this just on its own, but it's good to put down under uh, eyeshadow too. Okay, here we go, Wayne. Here we go, Wayne. Um, I'm gonna start with this kind of matty brown. Color. So, um, Everybody ready for 2021? I know I am for sure. Um, yeah, I've, um, you know, it's been a hard year for everybody and really looking forward to a new start. And I said to somebody the other day, you know, 2021 has gotta be better than 2020, but she said, what if it's not? And so, I don't know, we just have to make our own destiny, right? And so, a couple of really great things have happened the end of 2020, like Nicholas and Caroline getting engaged. I mean, it was just a fairy tale evening, and I'm so grateful that they, well, Nicholas included us in it. And um, so that proves that good things um, can happen. I don't know. And let's see what else. Oh, I'm getting lots of subs on my YouTube channel. That's good. And I think my gray white hair is coming in a little. So we gotta look. We gotta look at the positive things, right? We can't just always be, um, you know, a downer. Just 
not good for you, not healthy. And let's see, I'll use Wayne's black liner. A mix, I think. The black and the the black and the other oh, brownie kind of sparkly color. So Diane and I were talking to you about 2021 and um she said, you know, we are more resilient now. Uh, it was an 2020 was an eye-opening experience, and I am a firm believer that everything does happen for a reason. So, why ever this SHIT show of a year happened, it happened for a reason to make us more resilient, stronger. You know, I don't know. Eye-opening. I don't know. And then I am going to put this black eyeliner. This is Wet and Wild Breakup Proof um, eyeliner, and it does not budge. Does not budge. It's wonderful. And I think it's $1.98 at Walmart. Okay, maybe a little sparkly right in the middle, you think? I'll leave it there for a minute and put some bronzer on NARS. I just don't feel like I look scary. Okay, a little bronzer, all right? It's funny, YouTube shows you all this stuff about your best videos and everything. And, um, well, Graceland, Elvis was my num top number one. And then right under that is uh, Paris Island. Still today, Marie, I did that call. Over a year ago, Marines love talking about sharing their experiences when they were there. And it's fun. I like to engage and, and talk with them. If you guys want to know any of these products or you know need me to repeat them, just let me know and I'm happy to share. This Charlotte Tilbury um, blush is the bomb. so much. I'm really not. <laughs> then there's a little, kind of a highlighter thing in the middle, which is cool. I'm in trouble with my highlighter now because where I used to put it, there seems to be more wrinkles there now. Oh, that happened. Okay, let's see. Ooh, eyebrows. Oh, I did get a new eyebrow pencil. This is a benefit. Got a little darker color. And another good thing, my eyebrows are growing. See, we can find the positive. I should get that bronzer out of my eye. We can find the positive in anything. I'm gonna put some sparkly Wayne Goss on, maybe with just my finger. Normally, I just put it right in the middle, but it's New Year's Eve. I'm gonna put it all over. I'm also wearing, um, I think, ginormous, um, sparkly, blinged out earrings that I've had for a million years. I don't know, I say I am. I'll probably put them on and take them off. Maybe I should send this video to Wayne Goss. And see how his commoners use his palette. If you don't watch him, he's excellent. He's the kindest, sweetest, uh, really great makeup artist. And he started his own line. Brand. Okay, and I want... I want to put 
anything down below. But it is New Year's Eve. Go big or go home, right? Why not? Put some of this brown. Might be pretty. Maybe I'll put a little hourglass on there. This stuff is magic. And now I'm gonna spray my face and then I will um, put on the mascara. I always spray the setting spray first before the mascara. Oh, inner corner, inner corner, inner corner. Makes a big difference. This is Bobbi Brown Lip Oil. Oh, and it feels so good. So, so good. I don't know if that's what I'm gonna wear, but you'll see the finis finished product when I go down and do my intro to my video. This is just the makeup part. Anyway, I hope you like it. I love all my new makeup. Again, if you have any questions, just ask me. And um, Happy New Year. Um, forgot to put my mascara on. Um, the most important part is the mascara, which is the Chanel mascara that is, um, well, out of this world is the only way I can describe it. Just out of this world. I had a little tester and um, I also have a brand new tube that I got for a birthday present. I don't know if any of you have ever ordered anything from Chanel, but if you order directly from them, they send the most gorgeous packaging you have ever seen in your life. Like it's for a mascara, it looks like a, a diamond bracelet. And uh, the... <laughs> Packaging that that um, eyeshadow palette from Diane came in my birthday was um, insane. I don't know if you can see how wonderful this is, but you can just trust me. Okay, now. Now, um, I will fix my hair and put my costume on for the night, and I will see you soon.